Hi everybody, this is Roxy, and I have a quick Dollar Tree haul. I just needed to get some more things for craft sale items, and then I found something else. But I, first I'll start with this. I found this for a dollar. They got a ton of them, and I didn't have time to look through them all. Look how close set his eyes are. That weird Butch Cassidy and the Outlaw Trail. It's aired on public television. I wonder if that's KT's, you know what, channel tour, whatever it is. But anyways, I thought University of Utah, so it should be good. Hal Holbrook, I love him. So that's going to be fun for holiday viewing. I don't know why I said holiday. I found this adorable. I promised never to buy another tin. And I bought one anyways. Look at these. They're so cute. I had a dream. We had a trailer down at a, on a lake. It was like a two bedroom mobile home kind of thing. And my dream was I found a scamp in town for sale for 1200 bucks. And I wanted to buy it and put it outside our trailer for like a spare bedroom when guests came. But Scrubby just wasn't on board with it. And I just noticed this is dented. There. Well, it's a little dented, but... Salady! Anyways, so that's that. Isn't that cute? I got the best artwork. And I'm making, you know, I've got all those coffee mugs. I didn't disclose the full story when I showed my centerpieces. Those little trailers are so cute. I bought, I think I ordered a case from Dollar Tree two years ago. And then by the time they got here, it was too late to try to do anything with them. So then last year, I completely forgot about them. Out of sight, out of mind. I had them boxed in, you know, underneath the table downstairs and I completely forgot about them until this last year when I was you know digging out the art lair I found them and I'm like awesome and I not only had those I also had I think a half dozen or a dozen um, like Santa Claus faces and um, Santa Claus pants or you know like the belt buckle so I've got to get rid of them this year try to get rid of some of them so I'm going to do, like, I did all the centerpieces. I might do more for the next. I've got a sale this Saturday and another one in December. So how they go this Saturday depends on if I'll do more um, centerpieces because I still have some picks left. And I do want to explain. Somebody asked something, but I pulled all the picks apart. So I tore them all apart and then designed it that way, the centerpiece of that way. It's much easier than just, you know, clumping it in there because you really can't, you know, put the things where you want them. So I still have a lot of the pieces left that I can make, you know, a couple more. But anyways, I'm going to do like hot cocoa um, and mug in a cup. No, mug treat, like cake in a cup or whatever you call it. Cake in a mug. So I found these yesterday at the Dollar Tree. Just so happened. I wasn't planning on doing it, but I saw them and I thought, yeah. So I'm going to end this one of these. So I love that kind of cake. So you get you don't get the um, well the chips must be in the cake, but I don't think you get the treats for the frosting because it, it's a packet of frosting. But I figured you know what I was gonna do though, I'm gonna cut this out and um, fold it in half for like a little book to put in with it, and then put like all these instructions on the inside of it. That's my plan. Um, because otherwise, like the package isn't all that great looking. I just thought that might be a little cuter. See, it's like just kind of boring. And then here's the frosting for the brownies. But that's, you know, not real festive. But if you had a little picture, it might be cuter. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how it turns out. So I got two brownies, two cakes, and I got um, Swiss Miss hot chocolate. And I got some Intamin's K-Cups. So I'll make some with K-Cups. And I'll make some with 
to pack it. Because if you got a K-cup, you can use it. If you don't have a K-cup, I don't know. And then I'll throw some of these in. Give it some color. And these, I almost bought, I kind of, okay, they don't have as many in here as last year. Because this bag was full. Problem is, is they kind of stick together. So you got to gently break them, but they are so good. So I'll put one of those in and then wait till you see this. I almost died when I saw this. Little peppermint spoons. And they're all singly wrapped. So I can put one of those right in the thing. Right in the um, cup with it. Isn't that adorable? Look how cute these are. So I got two of these. And then I also have some of the... Um, isn't that cool? I also have some of the suckers. I put them in the freezer. There's snowman. You know, the snowman. Santa. Um, and there's a tree. And something else. Suckers. So I'll put maybe one of those. Look at it. It's so cool. Oh my gosh, how smart. A dollar. And you get six of them for a buck. So, you know, the cost of the... It's like a dollar. Probably a dollar... 70 if that with all the other stuff I'll have to cost it up but anyways oh I almost forgot they didn't have the trucks left They somebody bought them all out and I, my manager friend said I was going to try to save them for you I'm like well I know you can't so no I can if I get there in time but she said somebody came in and just grabbed them all but I did get this one this is pretty cute but I still want to find the one with the trucks. It's so cute. Go with that. All right, because be, I think this would be great for displays. I mean, that's kind of what I'm looking at. You know, like put some books in. Super cute. So that's my little haul. Um, what else is it? What's this? Oh, yeah. For that. These are really cute. They're solar bulbs. I thought you could put them in a window, but you got to hang them. So I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it or not. But they also have the solar lights you stick in the ground that are kind of solid color. But I think this would be pretty. I'm going to see how it looks, you know, at night, how much it lights up. Otherwise, I might exchange them out because I don't want to hang them in. Well, they could be. Maybe on the deck it would be cute. So anyways, well, we don't get any sun, though. That's the thing. We've got clouds all through the year. Cloudy sky, well, sometimes blue skies in the summer, but it's cloudy, completely clouded over, and it's going to probably be like that till about mm, June 5th. So, um, thanks for watching. Bye.